ready, Miss Lucy. I don't want noodles. Take this away and get me toasted bread and tea, because that's what I want for breakfast. But you told me it's noodles that you wanted. Like. What's this time here, you idiots? Clean up this mess, you idiots, and get me what I want for breakfast. And what on earth is happening here? Um, it's Miss Lucy. She requested for noodles previously, which I made for her. Then she said she doesn't want noodles again, I should. Mom, I want toasted bread and tea for breakfast. Lucy, baby, you're going to be late for school. But, Mommy, that's what I want to eat. James, clean up this mess and get her toasted bread and tea. Excuse me. Clean up this mess. So how are you? I'm fine. I'm just checking up on you to see how you're faring at work. I'm good though. Those are the people I'm working for are really giving me a tough time. Employers? When did you have two employers and who is the second person? No, the woman and her daughter. Her daughter is just something else. The girl is just so rude. She just giving me serious tough time and i'm just holding myself here like i'm just holding myself not to just not to just show myself because if i start i'm so sorry please be patient and what can i do now i'm patient now i'm patient please i i need some money to get my medication i've run out of my medicine and the doctor said not to miss any at all <sighs> Sarah, this is fine. I will. I'll run around at the moment. Now there's nothing, but I'll just, I'll just, I'll work on it. I'll run around and see how I can scrape out something. Okay. Okay. All right. Bye. Good. God, please help us. We are nothing without you. Please heal me. And grant my brother true happiness and job satisfaction. If only I had taken my medication that day. I wouldn't have passed out. Your clothes are here now, so just come back by this time next week. Your clothes go down ready. Please, oh, don't disappoint me. Oh. My friend that you made clothes for referred me to you. And when I saw the clothes you made for her, I loved it. That's why I brought this one. Please, I sew it very well. Because the people that have been making clothes for me, they, they will just spoil my material and I don't like it. I don't feel disappointed. You don't know me for this area. Sarah, the fashionista. Eh? I go do one for you. I go deliver. Are you sure? That one no be problem. That's why I'm going to make my spare At the end of the day, I go do one for you. I know they like that. But sure, dry away. Sure, dry away, sure. So I'm well, oh. So I'm well, oh. You give me full payment, oh. Me, see, Anna. Oh, because I know one here too. Thank you. I know my account now. You go tell me say now because say I don't see money to buy this one. I don't see money to now make me. I beg, I beg. I take one in the swan way. Okay, now my go now. Oh, wow. I beg swan way lo. No problem. Swan way lo. Hi. Thank God. My brother will be so happy. At least I can buy some things in the house. <sighs> Hey! Oh, God. I've not taken my medications for two days now. Oh, God. I'm 
I've been so busy. I forgot to replace them. Twice when? I'm so sorry. I'm so sorry for scaring you. It's fine. I'm causing it's you fine. to worry. It's fine. I'm just bothered that you don't want to listen to me. I ran out of my medications and I forgot to replace them. But I told you, I begged you to stop stressing yourself. You don't need it. You don't. You know, I can't afford to disappoint my customers. No, your health matters. But we need the money. I am doing everything possible to keep us going, am I not? You're all I have. I don't want anything to happen to you. I've been begging you, please stop stressing yourself. But you can't do all the work. I am doing, I'm doing it already. The best you can do for me is to listen to me. But you know I can't stop. So it takes my mind off this illness. Please don't do this. You have no idea how I've been feeling. What if when you passed out no one saw you? What if? What if? This is not good. This is not good for me. Please. You have to stop. Please. I'm sorry. It's fine. Let me call the doctor. If only I was not born with this illness, I wouldn't be a burden to my brother. Now he has to do this kind of job. Just to provide for us. <laughs> um, I'm coming. You too. Oh my god, you're welcome. <laughs> thank you, thank you. Sarah Vera. Yes. Hey, you're welcome. Good to see you. Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. Oh, so tell me, how was your trip? You don't want to know. My trip was splendid. Mm -hmm. Yes, I enjoyed every bit of it. I can see it's yes. all over you. <laughs> Do you know sometimes I get jealous? I'm like, yeah. I want to travel, mm -hmm. have fun, spend quality time to myself. But no, I'm always walking, walking, walking each and every day. I'm so tired. So sorry, I can't imagine. <laughs> I know. <laughs> um, you're welcome, my love. Thank you. You know, we only get to live life once, so you should enjoy it. And you can say that again. Mm -hmm. <laughs> <laughs> oh god okay enough of all that so yeah. what can i offer you um, let me think i'll do juice juice yeah just that mm -hmm. i'm okay juice is fine don't you want to eat something i can let my chef prepare you something delicious and you will like it trust me no Juice is fine thank you okay fine if you insist yeah juice. thank you my darling <laughs> james <laughs> James! Oh my God. Okay. James! Okay, what's going on? James! Yes, yes, ma'am. 
Sorry, ma. I was grinding our crop. Sorry. Um, prepare my friend a glass of juice. Fresh. Okay. Mm. Uh, you can do a mixture of uh, strawberries and orange. Yeah, that's fine. Yes, and please make it fast. Because you're becoming too lazy for me. Get out from my sight! See this one. Sorry about that, my darling. <laughs> Daniela. What? I left you for a bit and you got yourself a handsome cook. Hmm. Handsome. Cook. Yeah. Oh, please. Hear me that. Daniela. The fact that he's a cook, that doesn't make him less of a human or less handsome. <laughs> Vera. Yes. James is my cook. Okay. okay. I picked him up from the gutter, hired him, and I'm paying him good salary. And he's not here to be looked at. And by the way, what do you expect people to say? That I, I Daniela, is associating myself with a pauper. Oh, please. <laughs> come off it. Now, that's the problem I have with you. The <laughs> fact that you're a rich lady doesn't mean that you should treat people anyhow. I'm also a rich lady. You should know that. You should learn to treat people nicely, okay? <laughs> Vera. Yes. James is offering me his service in which I'm paying for. So don't act as if he's doing me a favor. <laughs> okay, if it's that easy, okay? If making money is that easy, mm -hmm. why a full grown man like him is in my house working as a chef? Daniel. Oh, please, Vera, come off it. Daniela, life is not black and white. You of all people should know that, right? You don't just go treating people anyhow you please. Learn to treat people nicely. And I will say it again. Learn to treat people nicely. Daniela, learn to treat people nicely. Vera. What? Vera, are you in my house to lecture me how to live my own life? Or you're here to spend time with me? All of the above. You must, you must be crazy. <laughs> But sincerely, you're my friend and you really need to learn to treat people nicely. Besides that, you know you don't have a life for yourself. Vera, enough of that, okay? It's okay! Come in. What do you want? Good day, ma. Ma, please, um, can I talk to you? And you think it's appropriate? <laughs> In what capacity do you want to talk to me? Because I, I am human and I, I work for you. And you think you're human enough to talk to me? Yes, ma. What do you want? Ma, please, I... I'm in dead need of money. I, I don't know if, if it's possible I get my salary in advance. I, I need to sort something which is very important. So you walk in my room at this hour of the day to ask for salary advance? For, for, uh, for a job you've not even done yet? Are you serious? I know that might be out of place. My, my, my sister, my sister has a hole in her heart. She, she needs money for medication. I, I, I can't even have afford it now because I don't have any money at the moment. It's, that's that's the reason I'm asking for it. I need to buy her medicine. And you think you can do whatever it takes to get the money? Yes, ma. You can start by massaging my feet. Pardon? Yes, by massaging my feet. You can start now.
Excuse me. I said you should massage my feet and not to stain it with your dirty tears. You know what? I changed my mind. Get out. Get out. Ma, ma, please, I, I need this money. Please, ma. I, I need this money. I can't give it to you. Get out of my room. Ma, please. James, please, I'm I talking you to God, you. Please. Get out of my room. James, get out. You're so annoying. Get out. Gosh. Disappoint her again. I really feel that's her brother. I don't even know what to tell her. What do I do? For now, why the urgent call? My brother, please, I, I need your help. I don't know if I can get any money from you. I, no. I, I, I tried um, borrowing from my boss, but let's let's forget about that one. But the thing is that I need money. I need to buy medicine for my sister. And as it stands now, I'm not even taking her calls because of it. Ah, you would have at least taken her calls now. You don't no. know why she's calling why, you. What will I tell her? I don't even know what to tell her. I don't want to disappoint her again. I've asked my boss for money. She's not even coming through. She's, she's, please, the thing is money. It's, it's money that I need. Can, can you help uh, me, please? I I don't have any money with me, but I, I have something in my account. I don't know if you can, you know, buy something for her. Oh, of course, any, any, anyone. I believe that can that, that can buy. I don't know how okay. much, but I believe it can help but, at least. What what medicine do I buy? That's the problem. Can, can you go to my house and, and ask her? Uh, at least go there and check on her and know how she's faring. She will tell you. Yeah. Okay, you know, you just get along now. I'll do it. Eh? Hey, thank you. Yeah, thank, no you. thank you. Thank you very much. Thank you. Thank you. All right, yeah, please go now. Eh? Go okay, now. Bro. Thank you. Thank you. Eh? No, i just stay. Be fair. I'm coming, okay? <laughs> oh, bless this guy. Oh, bless him. your food, baby. Wait there. Mom. Yes, baby. Why must he dress like this? What do you mean, baby? I have a surprise for him. And what could that be? Let's see. Okay. There you go. This is what a cook is to wear. And cooking is for women. 
So since a man like you wants to cook, this is the right clothes for you. But baby, this mommy, this cart is so little he can't fit in. And that's why you need to get him a bigger skirt because it's gonna be good on him. <laughs> He's a cook. So my love, you're so funny. You you really cracked me up this morning. <laughs> you're so hilarious. <laughs> Just look at him. Uh, okay, it's your fault. You're gonna be late for school. It's mom. <sighs> Alex, you're still here. I thought you left. Uh, yes, I, I went to get something. But I'm here now, doctor, please. How is she? She's not fine. We need to commence our treatment as soon as possible. Else, I can't guarantee what will happen to her. Uh, doctor, to be very honest with you, raising the amount of money is kind of very difficult right now. But is there nothing you can do, I mean, do to just keep on until the money is ready? See? That money is what we need right now to get her back on her feet. I had to do what I could in your absence to stabilize her because James is my very good friend. But like I said earlier, you need to deposit at least 200,000 in her to commence her treatment. 200,000? <sighs> Where would James get that amount of money from? Where? I thought he now has a job. Yes, yes, he, he does, but it's not even up to a month yet. And, and moreover, his salary is just 150,000 naira. It's going to be enough. There's nothing much you can do out here without the money. So please, the earlier you reach out to him, the better for us. Okay, doctor. I will. I will. Please. Th thank you very much for attending to her without money. You're welcome. But uh, we'll whatever sure. you need to do, Make it quick because our life depends on it. Okay, sir. We'll make sure we will get the money ready. All right. Thank you very Have much. Have a good day. You be careful, Lucy. Yeah, you just be careful. Hey, James! Can't you see I'm going out? Okay, uh, me, I they go out to my, my sister. My sister just called. She, she, she's not feeling fine. She, she, she's in the hospital. I'm rushing to the hospital to see her. Are you okay? Aren't you working here? She didn't be going anywhere. Didn't you hear that my sister is not feeling fine? And don't you talk to my daughter in that manner. And I say you're not going anywhere. Ma, my sister is not feeling fine. I need to go for her. She's all I have. And so what? And I am your boss. I say you're not leaving this compound. Get back in. And if you dare leave this compound, do not return. Excuse me. Baby, let's go. You're getting late. Ma, I said I need to go for my sister. I won't take time. I'll just go and come back. Please. My brother, of course you know that I need this job. I need this job more than the air I breathe. But what do you want me to do? Guy, guy, see, there are decisions you need to take regardless. She is your sister. Okay, if I wasn't here now, would you let her be by herself? Of course I know. I, I know that you're there for me, which I appreciate. But I don't know. Coming there now needs money. Will I just come there and be looking at her without doing nothing? That's the problem. I still need to come there with money. Well, what are you even saying? See, you have to come here right now. at the same time. See, don't make me talk too much. Just be coming here now, please. I'm waiting for you. How is she? Uh, she's... She's unconscious. James. Money is needed before anything can be done. The problem is how to get the money. Ah, talk to your boss now. 
or is she a witch? James, at least she can just give you something, even if it's just half of your salary. Trust me, if we get half of this money, something will be done. I don't want anything to happen to my sister. No, nothing will happen to her. I believe God. Please. Stop saying it now. Nothing will happen to her. God, please. God, please. Let me see her. She, she's in the world by your right. Don't forget, she's unconscious with James. Please forgive me. I don't have what it takes to be your brother. I am so useless. I'm not even there for you. I can't even do anything. I'm helpless. Mm -hmm. I don't deserve to be your brother. Didn't happen to her. Are you sure something is not wrong? Vera. I'm so mad right now. Do you know my daughter came back home three hours ago and is not home to welcome her or even take care of her? He doesn't look like an irresponsible fellow. I'm, I'm sure there must be a reason for this. And I will clear his, his doubt. This is my house. My daughter and I comes first. Like, I don't even care what he went out to do. I don't even care. But this is the end of him walking here. He's leaving my house today. Daniela, you have to calm down. Don't take this rash decision. I'm sure he has a reason for what happened. And I don't. Where are you coming from? Daniel! Tell me what is wrong with you. You can't just hit a grown up man like that. He's not a child. Where are you coming from? My kid sister slumped and was rushed to the hospital. I'm just coming from there. The doctor requested for for money. Without money that they won't touch her. And how is that my business? Your sister can die for all I care. I warned you not to leave this house in the morning. And you still left this house. You know what? This is the height of insult. Go in there, pack your things. You are leaving my house. Now, you are fired. Daniela, fired? Because he went to see his sister in the hospital. And he left my daughter alone in the house. Is that not a crime punishable by death? Huh? Hey! Daniela Lucy is not a child. She is 10 for heaven's sake. She can take care of herself. He's living. Please, man. I, I promise it will never happen again. It, it, it was urgent. It's a matter of life and death. And I had no choice. Please, ma'am. I'm sorry. I'm, I'm very sorry. It won't happen again. Please. Go in there, pack your things. You're living. He's not going anywhere. for my sister. Please. Just look at what you're doing to a grown-up man. Vera, what are you doing? Insulting me in his presence? No, Daniela, I am <laughs> not. I am begging you. Please, just give him a second chance. Please. I'm going in. Before I come back out, pack your stupid self out of my house. He's not going anywhere, Daniel. <laughs> just... 
just just done. It's okay, it's okay. You can just go in. It's alright, let's go. What are you doing here, Vera? Daniela, watch your tone with me. I do not work for you. Please don't give me the attitude. You undermined me in front of my worker and you want me to be happy with you? Oh, please. He told you his sister was in the hospital and you stopped him. Yes, I did. Daniela, since when did you become this evil? Someone's family member is fighting for her life and you asked him to stay back? Stay back for what? Work for who? If he watches his sister die, who will he spend his salary on then? Daniel, I'm talking to you. Vera, I employ James and not his families, okay? He should take my son and my daughter seriously. Daniel, you, you and your daughter are not gods. Who knows you? All you have is money and you expect the world to fall at your feet? I never said that. Daniela, humility is a virtue. Please. Daniela, you have to learn to treat people nicely. You did not get this far by your strength. If you don't treat people nicely, you have God to contend with. And you wouldn't want that to happen. Daniela, your lot. Leave him. I barely got my job back. So asking her for money now would be like asking for her life. But there's nothing I can do. I don't even have, I don't even know what to do at this point. Let nothing happen to my sister. I don't even know. How yeah, much do you need? Let, let me call you back, bro. Let me call you back. Sorry, man. Huh? I had everything. How much are the doctors asking for? Two hundred thousand. Two hundred thousand. Why is Daniela not giving it to you? She said she can't pay for the money. I haven't worked for. I should. I should work maybe at the end of the month. That she can. Is Daniela all right? It's okay. I would send the money to you. My mind is two hundred thousand. It's okay. Just give me your phone. I'll send the money to you. It's not too much. Hey, Mark, I will, I will pay you back whatever time. I will I pay you back. I don't want you to pay me back. It's for a good cause, right? It's to save, it's to save someone's life, so it's fine. Here you go. It's okay. Just God send it to you. me. I send it. Yes, that's fine. God bless you, Mark. God bless you. God, God bless and protect you, Ma. God, God. Lady, she's got sent. My dear, it's the only God that made that happen. I'm even surprised when she did it. Even the one I'm working for. Oh, God. It's fine. I'm very sorry for being a burden to you. Oh, you're not a burden to me. You're not. Nothing is going to happen to you. When we stay okay. together. I'm here. I'm here for you Feel all the time. Hmm? Uh -huh. okay. Say sweet words to one another. <laughs> Hold you closer. It's been 25 years. 25 years since we lost you. And it feels just like yesterday. <laughs> Happy birthday, little sister. I hope you're happy wherever you are. I miss you so much. I love you. I love you. Okay. Sorry, let's do it again. 
two. That's your turn. Two. One. I'm just adding one thing in two. Okay. Thank you, sir. What did you just call him? Sir? I mean, he's our cook, a servant in this house. I know he's a cook, but he's older than us. That's why you have to call him uncle. God forbid, he can never be my uncle. I mean, he obeys everything I say. And I can do anything to him. What do you mean? Let me show you. James! James! Come here. Kneel down. Pardon? You heard me right. I said kneel down now. Why? Why would you say that? He's not your mate. I know. But he has to obey me because he works for me, okay? He has to obey me. So kneel down. No, I don't work for you. I work for your mom. Even your mom can never tell me to kneel down. Even if she does, I will not talk more of a little brat like you. And what did you just call friend, me? Friend, shut up. I see you lack home training, right? The next time you try this nonsense, I'll, I'll spank the hell out of you. Very silly girl. I should kneel down like your mate. She asked him to kneel down and he refused. Like, why could he? Why? She was wrong, Auntie. He's older than her. And she insulted him. Even my little girl here knows better. And you think he is wrong? But he's getting paid! Yes, as a cook, but not to be punished. Daniela, how are you raising this child? What is wrong with you? I know that you were hurt by her father and he left you for another woman. But Daniela, that doesn't mean that you have to indulge her in everything because you want her to forget her father. Daniel, let me tell you something. You are raising a beast. Oh, please don't say that about my daughter. Don't you dare say that. I will say it. And for the love of God, I would not bring my daughter here again. Because your daughter is definitely a bad influence to her. Yes. Don't say that about my daughter. Being a mother doesn't mean you have to provide everything for your child. You also have to look after them. As a good mother, you need to be a disciplinarian. Okay, fine, Vera. So tell me, what do you expect? You want me to choose his side over my daughter? No. Are you okay? No. Regardless of who is involved, the person you're mistreating today is he not a human being. That is a person who is trying to make a living for himself by not stealing or defrauding people. Let me ask you something, Daniel. If he decides to hurt you and Lucy today, would you even survive it? Yes, I'm asking you, would you survive it? Listen to me, we're at the mercy of these people. From the gate man to the gardener to the cook. If they decide to hurt us, trust me. Before the police gets here, you'll be gone. So learn to treat people nicely. My baby, let's leave, okay? my friend against me. You useless, low-life creature. You are so unworthy to tie in my daughter's shoelace. And you want to speak? Are you serious? <laughs> James, you know what? I will let this one go. Yes, I will. But let me remind you, you will pay for this. You will surely pay for this day. Idiot. If not for one thing, I will never be in a place like this. Are you serious? So, so that little girl is ordering you about in the house. And her mother is doing nothing about it. 
I'm desperately looking for another job. And I believe God will help us soon. You, you'll, be, you'll be fine. Yes. <laughs> yes. <sighs> Sarah. Sarah. I'm, I'm fine. I'm fine. Sarah, are you okay? Sarah. 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 Jesus Christ. God. Oh my god, it's so funny. I know, baby. <laughs> Just look at his dress. That's <laughs> my so funny. <laughs> Mommy. Yes, baby. I want to know this. Okay, let me call James to get you. James! James! Where is this guy? Mom? James! Oh, okay. Um, Lucy wants some needles, so get it done as soon as you can. I'm sorry, I can't, Ma. I need to go for my sister. My, my sister slumped. And your sister more important than my noodles? Yes. She's more important than you, your mom, or this house. And don't you dare talk to my daughter like that! She is a kid! <sighs> She may be a kid, ma, but she doesn't sound like one. I'm sorry to say this, ma, but you didn't train her well. Your daughter lacks home training. If you leave this house, don't you bother to come back, because you are fired. I'm actually, I'm taking all these insults because of my sister. Of what use is this job to me if I lose her? Absolutely. James? What about my noodles? Baby, I can't go in that kitchen to make you noodles. You can get yourself bread and tea or anything you can find, please. But I want noodles. And baby, there's nothing I can do about it. Go get yourself something else. poor people with poor mentality. James is fired. He's never coming back here. Oh gosh. Doctor, please do something. The only solution out of this is a surgery, which we don't even have a donor yet because of lack of money. Or else we just have to keep looking at her like this till she takes in her last breath. No. Oh. My sister will not die. James, I don't wish the same for her. But she has fought this illness for years. Like, as I speak to you, her system is down. I don't know how long she can continue. But if you want to save her life, you need that money. Call whoever you can call. I don't know. Do something. But be fast about it, please. Oh, God. Oh, God. Oh. Good morning, Detective Mike. It's shocking to see your call this morning. Yes, that is because I have good news for you. Speak, you found my sister? Yes, and she's close to you. I can send you her address if you want. Oh my God, are you joking? Is this for real? Are you sure she's the one? I will not be calling if I'm not sure. Oh my God. 
Detective Mike, if truly you found my sister, I promise you, you will never lack any good thing in your life. I will give you more money and more connections, I swear to you. I will send you the address. Just keep to your end of the bargain. Are you, are you joking? Please do, send it as soon as you can. I, send it right away, please. Okay, bye. Oh my God. Oh my God. Viva, guess what? I found my sister, Detective Michael's founder, after so many years. And I'm going to see her. I'm just waiting for him to send the address to me. I'm so happy. Oh my God. Thank you, thank you. I'm so happy. I feel like my spirit is leaving my body. I'm so happy. Oh my God. I'm going right away. I'm just waiting for him to send me the address so that I can go at once. I'm so happy. I will be very happy if you can come along. But first, I will call you right back as soon as I get the address, okay? Okay, take care of yourself. Thank you, darling. I'm happy too. I'm so happy. Thank you. Oh my God. Oh my God. Oh my God. I found my sister after so many years. Oh my God. I'm going to be with my sister once again. I'm going to be with her. Oh, thank you. Okay, baby, that's fine. So I will see you soon, okay? Oh, okay, that's fine. I'll see you soon. Okay. James, what are you doing here? I came to collect the salary I worked for. Huh. You should give me a month notice before leaving my house, which you did not. So why should I pay you? With all due respect, Ma, I worked for three weeks. If not for anything, pay me for the three weeks I worked for you. I need that money, please. And that's not enough for me to pay you. Ma, please, I need the money. My sister is sick. I am not begging you for money. I'm asking you for the money I worked for. Pay me for the three weeks that I worked for you. Is it hard for you to do? And I say I'm not giving you a dime, James. Get out from my compound and do not show your ugly face here again, okay? Who do you think you are? You think you're God? No, because you have money now, you think you're God. Do you know tomorrow? I don't understand why you'd be so wicked to even, to even hold my salary. For Christ's sake, I work for three weeks. Can you please give me the money? Call the police. I'm not giving you nothing. I should call the police? Yes. I should call the police? Yes. It's fine. You're not God. But I promise you, you will lose something more precious than that money. It's fine. Just get out. No, it's fine. Hold Just it. Just get out! I won't say much. Say sweet words to one Idiot. another. <laughs> Hold you closer and never let you go. No matter what they say, I want you. No matter how they feel, I need you. I'll do every little thing just to be with you. And the most of all. I love you, babe. Yeah. You have to take her, James. I'm sorry. We lost her. I can't believe behind this door lies my sister, Vera. Then go in and meet her. Vera, honestly, I don't even know how I'm feeling right now. I don't even know. There's no already. Are you sure? Yes, I have, I have a good feeling. Let's just go. Okay. 
Vera? Yes? I can't believe my sister lives in this terrible place. Daniela. What? Are you sure this is the place? Yes, it is. I'm very sure. But why is no one around? Do you by chance have a picture of what she looks like now? I do, I do, but my phone is in the car. Okay. Daniela, is that no James? James? Yes, that's, that's James. James and my sister? What? Do you, do you think they are dating or what? Are you sure it's not his woman? Or maybe the same sister he has been talking about? Vera, I don't know. I don't know. Let's just ask around then. Okay. Yes, yes, yes. When we stay together. <laughs> Feel the lovely weather uh -huh. Say sweet words to one another What are you doing here? Actually, James... I, I'm, I'm not talking to you. I'm asking this witch. What are you doing here? Are you here to laugh at me? Are you here to laugh at me or celebrate that you've won? <laughs> what are you talking about? Stop! Allow me! Just stop! Relax! Allow me to this demon! The death of our medicine! Please, 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 just relax. How can someone created by God be so wicked? What are you doing here? Leave my house. Leave my house, James! Please! Leave my house! What's weird? But why are you raining insults on me? I'm not here to see you! I'm here to see my sister! What? Which one, which one is your sister? Okay. Everybody should just calm down. Actually, Daniela here came to, to look for her kid sister. And this is the address that was given to us. What do you know James stays here? What new drama is this? Huh? Please. I beg you with God's name, I don't have time for this. I just lost my only sister to the cold hands of death. Leave my house now! Leave my house! Yes, please, 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 please. What are you talking please. about? Who is this your sister you lost? I'm here to see my sister, the one you are in that picture with. That's my sister. Which one is what are you talking sister, about? Your sister, your sister. Wait. Are you, are you trying to say that Sarah is your sister? No, Lisa. Lisa is my sister. The person in that picture is Daniela's kid sister who got lost when they had accident as kids with their parents. Ever since then, Daniela has been looking for her younger sister. And we got an information by the detective that her sister stays here. And that's the only reason we are here. Lisa. Yes. Yes. Sarah, sister. Yes. Say sweet words to one another. <laughs> Hold you closer and never let you go. Sarah is my sister. We don't share the same parents, but my parents saw her wandering in the bush close to Okene River and brought her in. They searched for her parents, even, even reported at the police station then, but to no avail. So they took her in. That's how she became my sister. Hmm. Just like that? And why didn't you people try harder? Daniela, are you okay? What? He just said they tried. Didn't you try? How many years did it take you? Anyways, where is my sister? She's the only reason why I am here. Where is she? Well, it's quite unfortunate that that's your only sister. Who has been a sister over the years? She's no more. What? Wait. No more? What do you mean she's no more? 
You're very stupid to say that. Your sister was the same person I begged you over and over again to allow me go visit. What did you do? You said no. She's the same person I begged you money over and over again to save her life. What did you do? You refused. She's the same person you wished death. At every given time. Yes, that person is your sister. Listen after death. Are you mad? Are you mad? James. James. Are you mad? Why did I beg harder? Why did I beg harder, you ask? Please. I massaged your feet, right? Right? I pleaded every now and then. Please, pay me my salary. Let me save a life. What did you do? James. What? What did you do? She refused. The doctor even said her noodles was more important than her life. You insulted me. You said everything to save her life. You refused. You wished her death. You said her life was useless. She can never share the same blood with you. She can't. Because she was too pure. Her heart was too pure. It was too pure. Now she's dead. Now she's dead. <laughs> what have I done? What have I James, done? James, James, relax. James, 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 to say I told you so. Now look, you oh have all God. the money but you do not have a sister. Yeah. Material things are important. Yes, you cannot place them above human lives and humanity. I know. James, he gave her a life <laughs> and a roof over her head but, but you, you took that away from her. <laughs> With your single <laughs> act of cruelty. I know, I know, babe. <laughs> Okay, okay, just come here. It's okay. It's okay. <laughs>
when we stay together <laughs> feel the lovely weather uh -huh. say sweet words to one another <laughs> hold you closer and never let you go no matter what they say I want you no matter how they feel I need you I'll do everything what are you doing here? please I beg of you hear me out please I beg of you just hear me out please talk to him please talk to him you need to come here Just come, let me hear you out. Come, let me hear you out, fool. James, don't, 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 don't go, please, please. Vera, I know what I did is wrong, terribly wrong, but she's my sister. Vera, I just need to know the barrier arrangements, and if possible, I handle everything myself. But he keeps, he keeps chasing me like a thief. Vera, I need your help. I know he listened to you. Vera, can you please talk to him for me? I beg you in the name of God. Please. Vera, please, I beg you. I just need to know the plans for my sister's burial. Please, I beg you. James. James. I know what Daniela did was wrong. Please, we'll think about your sister. Would she not be happy to have finally met Daniela, regardless of the kind of person she is? I'm here for the burial arrangement. That's why I'm here, please. The same person she killed with her words? Please, you guys should just leave me alone, please. James, please. James. James, please, let's not dwell in the past. Let's move ahead. James, please, if not for any reason, for my sake, Remember, I was there for her. James, please. James, I am begging you, please. James. James. Look, I'm just doing this because of you. Thank you. At least you were there for her. But if she wants to talk, she has to come here. I'm not going to her house. That's fine. Fair enough. That's okay. I would love to bury my sister. I would love to give her a befitting burial. Who is your sister? Does she know you? She was my sister. I'll bury her myself. We don't need you. The same person that I begged you for 150,000 naira, my salary, to buy her medication. What did you do? You seated here. You want to give her a befitting burial. Are you not shameless? You couldn't help her when she was alive. Now you want to bury her in a befitting way. James, I know what I did, and I regretted everything. But please, just give me a chance to do something for my sister. Even if it's in death, I beg of you, James, please. We don't need you. Are you daft? We don't need you. I will give her the burial I can afford. The grace I'll give to you is tell you the day and the venue of the burial if you choose to come, fine. If not, then that ends it. James, please. Please, I beg you. James, please. You asked for us to see, right? Now we have, so can you leave? James, I know that you're hot. But I'm sure you and I know that you don't even have the money for this burial. Allow Daniela to do it. No matter what you want to say or do, she still remains her sister. 
James, please, keep your ego aside and do the right thing. It's very, very important. Please. Please. James. James. Are you listening to me at all? She was lucky. Life gave her a brother that loves her so much. <laughs> I'm so sure she lived a happy life. James, thank you so much for everything you did for my sister. Thank you for the love. Thank you for the care. Thank you for the sacrifices. Thank you so much. Thank you. God bless you. Thank you. You did so much for my sister. And I would love to do something for you. Come with me. I know you're a graduate. I will get you a better job. I'll be an ingrate if I leave you here after all you did for my sister. Please. I am not a charity case. Whatever I did, I did it for the love. I did it because she was also nice to me. So don't come with this and uh, leave you here. I don't care, okay? Don't tell me this bullshit. James, that's not what she means. She just wants to help. Please. James, I know you have pride, but combining it with poverty is detrimental to you alone. What do you mean? Which one is what do I mean? It's not like she's even doing you a favor. Okay, you worked for her, right? And she didn't pay you. So it's not like you're even begging her for arms. This is an opportunity you need to take. James, take it. If you want to pay her back, I don't care. And I don't care anything you want to do tomorrow, but please get your life together first. Trust me, Sarah will like it. When we stay together <laughs> Feel the lovely weather uh -huh. Say sweet words to one another <laughs> Hold you closer and never let you go No matter what they say I want you no matter how they feel, I need you. I'll do every little thing just to be with you. And the most of all, I love you, babe. I love you. So what next? Uncle James, you're here? Why did you call me? I'm so sorry, Uncle James. I know I've been bad to you. I've been a bad girl. I'm so sorry. Please forgive me. Hey, sister. Daniela, 
What? Is it just me or you're beginning to like him too much? Oh, please. It's in your head. Is it? <laughs> but hmm. he's not bad at all. Oh, now you know. <laughs> Sharon, I was telling you about him. You're like, my cook. I don't do that. Oh, please. Do it's okay. I hear you. <laughs> Are you smiling too much? Can never live without you. Go, you know it's so true. Go, you are my lady. Show you are my lady. Place no one above you. Since the day I found you. Go, you are my lady. Show you are my lady. Gotta let you know. I'm gonna love you like never before. Huh. Treat you good, show you the world Yes, it's true, everything you want, baby, I do for you Oh my, everything you want, baby, I do oh, Gotta let you know I made a reservation for two Oh baby, you, I wanna spend my whole life with you huh. Yes, it's true, everything you want, baby, I do Oh my, for you can never live without you Go, you know it's so true Go, you are my lady I think my friend likes you Who's your friend? Well, Stanella, of course Likes me? Yes, she likes you <laughs> Where's that coming from? You've not noticed? Noticed? Mm-hmm Daniela, your friend, can never like anyone. She has a dark heart. Sorry to say this, but she has such a bitter heart. No, that means you don't know Daniela. She's not that kind of person, trust me. You know, Daniela had a tough time growing up, and that's why it's very difficult for her to let someone in, but she's a sweet soul. You should just give it a try. Sorry, but I really don't know what to say. You don't have to say anything. Just flow with it. And maybe you could just encourage her a bit, show her how to love, and that way things will work out fine. Trust me. Together. <laughs> Feel the lovely weather. Uh -huh. Say sweet words to one another. <laughs> Hold you closer and never let you go. No matter what they say. Hey, good morning. Oh, good morning. Yes, I'm sorry I woke up late. I was up all night studying the activities of the company, so I'll be able to fit in. That's fine. Sit, let's have breakfast. Please don't worry about me. I can take care of myself, sort my stuff. Why don't you allow me to do things for you? Why do you always keep rubbing my sins on my face? You're breaking me, you know. Please just sit and eat with me. Please. Thank you. No matter what they say, I want you. No matter how they feel, I need you. I'll do every little thing just to be well done. You. And the most of all, don't, don't worry, huh? don't worry. Let me let me continue from this. This one, you can, you can see. I think we need house help and this house. No, we don't need it. I believe we can do whatever I want to do collectively. Okay, it's fine if you say so. Thank you. You're welcome.
one movie are you watching? It's James. Oh, good one. James, how long will this continue? We live in the same house. You get along with Lucy all of a sudden, but you keep on avoiding me like a plague. Why? Because I don't want to overstep my boundaries. <laughs> I've apologized to you. I've said sorry a thousand times. Why can't you, why can't you look beyond my mistakes and forgive me? <laughs> I'm swimming in guilt. Please just give me a chance. Okay, better still, just give us a chance. Please. Us? There's nothing like us. Let's not deceive ourselves. Okay, fine. I like you, no doubt. But I like you more for what you did for my sister. Can't you see? So you want to compensate me with that? Oh no, no! Don't even go there! Don't! So what? It's fine. It's fine. And then, um, what about you now? What do you feel about her? Doesn't matter. She's she's changing and desperately trying to be a better person. But how can I forget all that she did to me? Because you're not her. You're a better person, James. You're not like her. Trust me, if you like her, I don't see any reason why this won't work. I'm serious. Don't give me that, please. Don't give you what? You know you're better than her, James. I'm sure you don't even know what God has in store for you. Vera, this guy don't believe anything I say. He doesn't trust me. He doesn't even like me. Daniela, who told you so? I know, Severa. I know. I believe no one in this world will treat me better than a man, than a man that sacrifices pride and dignity for a total stranger. Vera, this man gave up everything he has for Lisa. Vera, this man has so much love in his heart. I don't want to miss out of it. I know, right? See, Daniela, he's human, okay? I'm sure he still feels hurt. <laughs> Vera, yes. I know, I know I've been a very horrible person, but I'm changing, I've changed. Vera, I just need this man in my life. I need a good man like him to set me straight. Vera, I love him, I love him. With all my heart, I need him in my life. I need I know, him. I know. He will come around, okay? Just give him time. <laughs> give him time. He's not as <laughs> evil as you think, right? Easy. Sorry. Uh, I'm fine. I'm fine. Where are you taking me? It's for you to buy Huh? What? Stay, ma. Stay, ma. Huh? Yes. Stay, ma. to sleep okay no i'm not i'm not drunk why do you hate me so much 
I'm not bad anymore. I said I'm sorry. I don't, I don't hate you, rather. If I hate you, I won't be helping you. <laughs> On the bed. Do you love me then? Uh, Ma, I think. D I... Don't leave me. Don't go away, please. I'm so lonely. Don't go. Please come and stay with me. Please. Ma, let I... me get you water. No, no, I'm fine. Just come and stay with me. Please don't leave me. Please. Come, come and lay down here. Come here, please. Now, what kind of drink did you take this one? I'm fine. take advantage of a drunk woman. Are you sure? Sure. Oh, okay. Here. This is going to help you with the hangover. Thank you. You're welcome. I'll be in my room. That's fine. No, I'm fine. I'm not drunk. James, I mean everything I said to you yesterday. I know I've not been a good person to you, but I'm trying. I know I've done so many wrongs to you. But the short period you've been with me, You've changed me a whole lot. I need you, James. What are you saying? James, what is it? Am I not appealing to you? Am I not beautiful for you? James, I just need you in my life. I want you. Please don't say no. Please. Alice, it's not about how beautiful you look. It's about your heart. I've looked closely and I... I think truthfully you're, you're really sorry for all you did. It's fine, I forgive you. Thank you. Do we call this? Yes, it's true. Everything you want, baby, I do. Not every relationship has a name. Let's just keep it going. What time will know what to call it? 
also tell me do you regret this i don't <laughs> Life is indeed strange. I have always been my own woman. But today, I see why poor people are happy regardless of what condition. Because they have real people around them. People who will support them through thick and thin. I have made a lot of mistakes in my life. But hiring James is the best of them all. Yes. I lost my sister, but I gained a lover, a true lover. Someone who will not judge me or cast me, but rather someone who will show me the beautiful side of life that money cannot buy. I am lucky, truly lucky.